This is our tempo goblet box squat. So tempo is gonna mean that we're gonna control the pace on the way down and on the way up. We're gonna go three seconds down and three seconds up. Box size, for Janelle this is gonna be 16 inches. We know we're at a good box height if the thigh is pretty much horizontal. I don't want your hips below your knees for this. A little bit above is that can actually be fine. It just changes what muscles we hit as we go through the box squat. Goblet is just gonna tell us that we're holding a kettlebell or a dumbbell in the goblet hold up in front. Foot position, Janelle's feet are a little wider than her, than her hips, turned out by the toes maybe 20 or 30 degrees. So Janelle, go ahead and bring that dumbbell up in front. And then why don't we go ahead and stand and we'll start the first rep from standing. So this is gonna be a three count down and for most of us this is slower than we wanna go. So Janelle's gonna move three, two, one. Light tap on the box, three, two, one. Let's just do that one more time. Three, two, one, and up, three, two, one. Janelle, you can go ahead and rest. Guys at home, as we go through the tempo goblet box squat, I want you to be sure that you are feeling strong muscular engagement on the outside of the quad and on the outside of the hip. That really should be what's dominant for this particular variation. And that is our tempo goblet box squat.